I'm Dionza Duran, and today we're talking about nap time, and this is my nine-year-old granddaughter, Kennedy, my baby. I bet you just loved taking a nap when you were a little one, didn't you? Mm. I don't think so. I didn't think so. Moms, trust me, I can empathize with you if you're struggling with your little ones at nap time. That's exactly why we wrote the song, Everybody's Taking a Nap, because um, it can be good time or it can be a bad time at naps. And uh, this song is available on uh, iTunes. Did you know that? It's available on iTunes and our website on our CD one. And it simply goes like this. Everybody's taking a nap. All the fishies in the sea and birdies in the trees. Everybody's taking a nap. And so am I. I. Well, you know, I love nap time, and, and when it goes good, it's wonderful. But I've found that really my dialogue and my um, attitude was key to how well it went. And the extra energy that it took at times was well worth it. Here are five uh, hints, that uh, tips that maybe will help you. Number one, uh, use your clout, parents. You know, all morning, all afternoon before those nap times, your kids are asking you things. Why? Because that's what kids do. They ask for this game or that snack or whatever. And when they do, that's the time to use your clout and say, sounds like a great idea to me. But you promise me that when it's nap time, you're going to lay down and go to sleep. Is that a deal? And so that's called leveraging your authority. And I make no apologies for it. Do it. Number two, um, making a plan to do something fun after nap time is really effective because it distracts them from the current horrors of having to lay down, be still, and take a nap. They begin to think, they're distracted, think about, hey, I want to get this nap over because I want to go do that fun thing that mom says we're going to do. So always plan something fun after the nap. And, and number three, when it actually comes time for nap time, lay down with them and uh, slow things down, tell them a story, sing them a song, or do both. But I found it was very effective for me if I would um, make sure they closed their eyes and got still. And they love hilarious stories. My grandchildren, the crazier the story, the better, like polka dot baby elephants swimming in a river of ketchup. Yes, they love it. So get your own stories. I don't know. I don't know where that story came from, but uh, keep their attention. And it just I had to learn to slow it down, to be patient, but also to be firm. Number four, um, you know, when it actually comes time to being still and going to sleep to have that countdown. And I'd say, okay, I'm counting down. Five, four, three, two, no more moving. And, uh, and the last one is simply this. If you have time, if it's possible, why not lay down and take a nap with them? Um, there's no better investment. Uh, you don't have to feel guilty that you're laying down. Uh, it's probably the smartest thing you could do, a little power nap, and you'll be with your baby. Uh, just remember to keep it simple, keep it sweet, uh, and keep it quiet. Some parents use noise machines, others use the app on their phone, but it helps to drown out the noise and helps them to sleep a, a little longer. You know, sometimes in reality, it does come down to just the learning, the harsh uh, reality of I'm the adult, you're the child, you're going to sleep because I told you to, you need one. If you don't obey me, there's gonna be consequences. If you obey me, there's gonna be rewards. So come on, go to sleep. I know you're gonna go to sleep now because we're going to have a good time when you get up. Uh, nap time, sleep time really are priority opportunities for you to make memories uh, with your children, to be together. So I just encourage you, don't give up. Don't give up on your kids. Don't give up on yourself. And most of all, don't give up that your kids really can become best buddies. You want to help me say bye-bye? Bye-bye. <laughs> Everybody's taking a nap All the fishies in the seas The birdies in the trees Everybody's taking a nap And so am I So close your eyes The father wants to talk to you This little 
Morning Song will help you if you're having a hard time taking a nap. Or maybe it'll just remind you to slow down and let God give you His peace and His rest. Just close your eyes and rest in His arms. He's taking care of all of us. Everybody's taking a nap All the fishes in the sea And birdies in the trees Everybody's taking a nap